It's Sunday, July 21st, 2024, and so much for a slow news day, slow news weekend. We thought we'd be talking about the prep for the new running ticket that is Donald Trump and J.D. Vance and going forward and more bitching and complaining and griping about Joe Biden being too old to run. Apparently, Joe Biden realized he's too old to run. And as of today, about maybe an hour or so ago, literally minding my own business, enjoying a slow news Sunday, watching a movie, turned off from politics, texting my friend saying, turn on your TV so you can start screaming at it. Turned on my TV, started screaming at it. President Joe Biden, still our president, we'll get to that in a moment, has dropped out of the race to run for president in 2024. So he's no longer seeking a second term. The last president to do that was, of course, um, Johnson, who decided to drop out of the race when he should have ran for it, or more or less was running for it, going forward. Now, it became an issue where I literally had in the feed for the rest of the day two other prominent Democrats saying that Joe Biden should drop out of the race to see what you talk about with that one. Apparently, he listened to those two Democrats and Pelosi and Obama and maybe even his wife to say this was not the time to do this. Now, what are we looking at right this very moment? President Kamala Harris, apparently it took a while to get that, which is also odd, now has the full endorsement of Joe Biden for presidency, which means the money from the Biden-Harris ticket is now the money for the Harris-Whomever ticket. What does it mean for the whomever part? We don't really know because this is literally breaking news going forward. And I've not seen any response from Harris yet. I've not seen response from Trump or Vance yet, to be honest, or official RNC type of response going forward. Don't know what it means in the full scale of things other than the fact that Joe Biden is no longer in the race. He's still suffering from whatever complication he has with COVID-19. So we're praying for cover in that one. We have heard calls from various Republicans, uh, the ones who have been saying he's too old, who say, well, if he's too old to run uh, in six months for the next jo- for the job, maybe he's too old to be the, in the job for the next six months. Maybe he should drop out and just give it over to, to Harris now. Wouldn't that be something? But that's not what's happening, at least not so much we know. It is breaking news as of this afternoon. It's about 2.58, 3 o'clock Central Time on this Sunday, the 21st of July. Joe Biden's out. He's calling it quits. The manager took to, went to the mound and took his ball away, and he's going to go hit the showers. What do you think about that? Give me your comments in the comments so we can get, talk, this, talk this one up. And we're prepping. We're processing. I'm screaming at this monitor right here with Rachel Maddow explaining going on and Joe Biden's kind of scrunchy face of what's happening because no one knows at this point. This is uncharted territory. We are all in for the thick of it. Comment to the Conversation Project. Send me uh, emails at the Conversation Inbox, email.com. Send me uh, information on the social medias. Let's talk about this one because this is going to ripple around the world.